and it's the next episode of Versus. Today is Old Board versus New Board. So, this is going to be the video that, similar to the video that I made last year. But I was talking about why they use their pop. That's going to be similar to this one. We're going to be talking about old board and this new fresh board. So, the difference is how I can tell if you, your deck is old is that it has a lot of board slide marks and no slide marks or a lot mostly a lot of old board which have and it has razor tail as you can see right there now the new deck has has a good tail but this has been used a bit and and it's really fresh and I like it so and and a new board will get make you do all these higher or other tricks because they have a good tail and and the old board has razor tail as you can see right there that won't be good to do an ollie. Okay. Trying to do an ollie and you hide an old board. No, you want the ollie is high because your board's not too fresh as you like it used to. But a new board is is better to do an ollie higher on because it's new. And I'm gonna tell you how can you tell if your components are too who old now. How can you tell if your your trucks are too old if it has 50-50 marks, lots of marks on it, lots of stuff if they're getting stripped or or something like that? Now if you tell how you can tell if your wheels are getting too old. Now the wheels are smaller than they used to when you first got them. That's what some wheels get, they get sometimes get smaller when they get too old. Oh, and how can you tell if your bearings are too old? How can you tell if your bearings are too old? That's fully self-explanatory. Um, uh, if you're not, if they're not rolling really good, if they're not like they used to, or they're getting rusty, or they've been skating mud, so, but how you can clean your bearings? is by using some speed cream to clean them um, just to make them move faster now this now you have, if you could tell if your grip tape is getting too old it's not I was grippier like it used to be and it's all dirty it has lots of dirt on it and stuff like that. That's how you can tell if your grip tape is too old. And the new deck has some grippy grip tape, new grip tape. It's really grippy. And mob grip is very good, great. That's why I got mob grip because it's grippier. But a new board has to get used to. You gotta break everything in and get used to it. And that's probably why when you start to do tricks, um, you don't land it the first try because you're not used to it skating it because you just got it or something like that. But everything's fresh on this deck. It's really cool. Well, it has a little bit of scrape on it, on the nose and the tail. But, a new deck is, is much better than an old deck. If your deck's getting too old and too soggy, you could get a, you have to get a new deck. It's better to get a new deck when your, your old deck is getting too old and soggy and doesn't pop really well. Yeah. Oh, if you leave your board out in the rain for 
if it was raining for three days and it was out there for the entire time it was raining, your boy could definitely lose its pop. And it'll be bad. You guys probably won't like it. Because the wooden glue will start to soften up. You can see what happens. And what happens when the wooden glue starts to soften up, you, you won't be able to, to pop as good enough. And that was the difference between an old board and a new board. Subscribe, like, and leave a comment down below. Peace.